I wanna dance by water neath the Mexican sky Drink some margaritas by swing the blue lights Listen to the mariachi play at midnight Are you with me? Are you with me? Od Bekaški savjezu saradnji sa trenerskom organizacijom se potrudio da dobijemo organizaciju ovog seminara, da bi smo vam omogućili da dođete u priliku da polažete ovaj kurs i da omogućimo da dođete u situaciju da dobijete jednu ovako prestižnu licencu koja će vam sigurno sutra biti od značaja u daljem radu. Nadamo se da prevashodno da ćete se dobro osjećati u Crnoj gori, da ćete, inače se znate svi, imati puno prostora da ono zašto ste tu, da čujete šta ljudi kažu, da naučite neke nove stvari, naravno da se družite i mi kao savjezom želimo puno uspjeha u radu i da svi uspješno završite ovaj seminar, na kraju da dobijete ove licence i Želim vam buduće pune uspjeha u vašem poslu, u životu i nadam se da ćete se sjećati Crne Gore sa zadovoljstvom. Izrazio bih zahvalnost FFB što je prepoznao i podržao kandidaturu od Bojkaškog savjeza Crne Gore za organizaciju ovog seminara. Mislim da je u Bojkaškom savjezu prepoznao referentnog partnera i Siguran sam da ćemo svi zajedno opravdati tu nominaciju koju smo dobili. Ovaj seminar je početak jednog sadržajnog i dugoročnog plana edukacije od vekačkih trenera u Crnoj gori. O značaju edukacije svakako nema razloga ni potrebe da nešto više govorim jer to je više nego poznato. Siguran sam da će od Bojkaški savjez biti dobar organizator, još bolji domaćin, a na vama je, drage kolegnice i kolege, da na kraju ovog seminara pokažete zavidno znanje koje se očekuje kako bi na bazi organizacije i dobrih rezultata mogli da u nekim budućim vremenima ponovo aplikujemo za neku kandidaturu za neki veći level. Svima... Želim uspješan rad i sve najbolje, naravno, najbolje rezultate na kraju svega ovoga. I welcome you all to the course level one Olympic solidarity. I am, uh, my name is Ibrahim, I'm from Iran. And uh, yesterday, day before yesterday, we qualified for the first time for Olympic. Congratulations. Thank you. Uh, I'm very happy to be in Montenegro for the first time. And uh, I hope uh, we are going to have a very pleasant five days course in Montenegro. Uh, but uh, I want to thank you, Mr. Pajkovic, the president of the Federation in Montenegro, and uh, I want to thank Mr. Uh, Paskovic and uh, Dragana, and also my, near, uh, my new colleague from Great Britain, Britain uh, Simon. This is the first time I'm working with him. It's my pleasure to work with him. Uh, I know for this course, there are so many people in Montenegro uh, they are trying to set up this situation. I want to thank all of those who are working with this class with any ways they can. And uh, I'm sure we are going to have a very good class because uh, this area is a volleyball area. Is uh, Serbia, uh, and uh, all these nations around here, they are the very good in volleyball. I'm sure you are all good, you are, all, all of you are good volleyball player. And, uh, but uh, what we are trying to do in these courses 
to give our experience to you and see your experience for ourselves, you know. So uh, I'm sure we're going to see some uh, new experiences from new drills and get some new ideas from you. And we try to give what we have learned in the past to you. And I hope we be able to give something new to you and help you to what you are doing. I'm sure you are working with volleyball, with youngsters in a school, wherever you are. I hope uh, you'll be successful in your uh, uh, career. Uh, and uh, I have uh, some experience myself from the past in Iran and uh, vol Asian volleyball. And I try to present whatever, what I have learned to you. I hope uh, uh, we finish this class successfully. Hopefully, everybody passed the course and uh, uh, leave here with a good memory. Thank you very much. Uh, good morning. Uh, I'd just like to echo all the thoughts and well wishes from uh, the rest of the panel. It's uh, very exciting to be here. It's a very beautiful country. And I was very lucky to see a, a beautiful match for Montenegro last night, uh, where they, they beat France. Uh, very good. And to, as Ibrahim says, uh, you guys know volleyball. You have a good culture of volleyball. And it, it is fantastic to be here. And uh, thank you all for your hospitality so far. Good luck. Good luck. Thank you. See you. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, we have a list of participants here. Fortunately, there is uh, many coaches from Montenegro, but there are some uh, coaches from uh, different countries here. Uh, what I was, uh, what I see here is uh, uh, seven nationalities are here. You know, of course, most of the. Uh, participants are from Mon Montenegro, but there are some from Bosnia and Serbia. Uh, here I see from Turkish, Greek, uh, Croatia, uh, Slovenia, and uh, Croatian. Uh, this is great, you know. So we have uh, coaches from different countries, so we can see uh, different uh, experience from people with different, uh, different ideas. Uh, this is very good. This is the first time uh, I'm uh, participating in a class with this variety of countries, you know. Uh, there are some uh, things that I like to mention here. Your participation in the class, your presence every day on time is very important for us. So I hope I, I, I understand, you know, sometimes something comes up and uh, some uh, some the person must do it, you know. Uh, I understand that one's some uh, uh, ex, uh, difficulty. Uh, we see that the person should uh, leave the class for one hour or two hours. You know that's that happens. You know in our country also we have the same situation that something comes up and that. Uh, participant must uh, leave the class for one hour or two hours. That's that acceptable, you know. But uh, participation in the in the class every day, on time, uh, practical and uh, theoretical is very important uh, because uh, that brings the enthusiasm for us that everybody likes to be present and likes to learn and likes to ask. So this is very important. Uh, about the language, uh, I ask, you know, we, I was kind of worried about the, uh, are we are going to have a translator? Fortunately, they said uh, everybody understands the English very good. So no problem. In this class, usually for uh, FIB class, we have two, uh, uh, what do you call it, the uh, attestation and uh, uh, certification. Uh, 
Uh, attestation, everybody get the attestation. If he, if he is present or she is present in the class, they get the attestation. For the certification, we have to give the exam, the practical exam, and, uh, and a written exam. And I'm sure most of you uh, don't have a, con don't, I don't see any problem for a practical exam because all the volleyball players, I see the uh, postures are all tall and uh, I can see that all of the volleyball players are here. Uh, but for written exam, we give some material during the course uh, the, in the lecture and we emphasize the uh, material, you know, so if you're taking a note and listening and you are present in the class, you should not have any problem for written exam too. Uh, the, the last day of the course is the worst day of the course because we talk about examination, everybody get nervous, uh, but uh, that's uh, something natural, you know. Every time in our life we want to take a test, we get nervous. Uh, I'm right. I'm driving for 60, 50 years, but when I went to California, I want to take a driving exam. You know, I was very nervous. You know, after 50 years, that's I think is natural things. You know, but uh, we try, and I hope you try, that uh, we finish this class successfully. Everybody pass the course. Everybody get the certification from FIBB, and hopefully we see you in. Uh, future in a level two and level three and hopefully uh, national teams have, uh, and you we see that you're doing a successful work. Uh, during the course there are things come up and we discuss and you have I'm sure you have some questions that's okay we, we are here to uh, cooperate together and finish this class successfully and uh, this class Usually, we do it in 12 days, uh, in a regular basis. But this class is only five days, so it's kind of more uh, uh, heavier time we are going to have. And we have to cover more material in five days. Uh, and it's, this class is for uh, how to play volleyball, level two, how to teach volleyball, level three, how to coach volleyball. This is for children and uh, working with children is very hard. Uh, all the good volleyball players we see in Serbia in wherever are the product of the coaches working with children. Children uh, very important. So if you are working with children, girls or boys, you are having a very tough task and uh, you are doing very important work for your country, forever you are. Uh, well, I let Simon talk a little bit about uh, this course. Uh, uh, I don't know say fortunately or unfortunately, this is his first time. So be nice. <laughs> Everybody must be nice to him. But uh, 20 years ago, I was in his position. First time 20 years ago, maybe, yeah. A little bit less. 20 years ago, I uh, started working with the FIBB. Uh, I had the same feeling, you know. But, uh, you know, he's coaching the Great Britain uh, national team. He has a tremendous experience in volleyball, as you have. Uh, when I, um, when uh, FIBB contacted me, go to Montenegro, I said, the Montenegro is a uh, uh, center of the volleyball. Uh, Serbia, Slovenia, Montenegro, all these countries around here are the best uh, team sports. I remember that, that, that team sports in this area, your area, is the best. Uh, volleyball, basketball, water polo, and uh, handball, and all these things. I, I uh, always talk about the ex-Yugoslavia extra good Yugoslavia, they're very good in teaching team sport, very good in teaching team sports, uh, the best. So I'm not surprised that uh, you are very good in volleyball. Okay. <laughs> Thank you. 
Uh, not too much to add. I, I think as, uh, as Ibrahim talks about, because the course is very short, uh, the FIVB now do the online course uh, that you, you should be sent a link. It's very important that you complete this as part of the course. So if you haven't, try and spend some time to make sure you go through that. Uh, it helps with the context, it helps with the, the preparation for the, the classes and the, the sessions that we deliver. Uh, so it's really all I have to add at the moment. Uh, what we'll try and do is we're going to try and with uh, some help from the organising committee, make sure the, the logistics are good. So we're not always travelling back and forward from the, the sport hall to here. We do all the theory here. Um, so we try and maybe do a morning, we'll be practical, and then the afternoon we'll be here for the theory and we maybe change. And then, <coughs> excuse me, for the the practical exam, we, we will offer... Uh, sessions for you guys to practice, the skills, uh, which we'll introduce tomorrow. So you have lots of time to, to practice and work with each other. So as the exam is very straightforward and very easy. Uh, like Ibrahim says, we, we want everyone to pass, so we make it easy for you. Uh, I think it is important that for me, certainly, that we have a dialogue. It's not just all one direction. So if you have questions, if you have uh, things you're very uh, passionate about and have been, uh, strong feelings on, then we can have the discussion, the debate, and uh, hopefully we can exchange ideas. So uh, I look forward to it. So. Uh, well, uh, in the last two, three weeks, uh, I had the contact with a uh, coach from uh, Turkey. Uh, is he here, Okan? We don't have anybody from Turkish because he contacted me several times that he wants to participate in this class, and uh, he was in, uh, he was very a little bit worried about his English, but he was writing to me very good. I said you should not have any problem. You should just contact the uh, volleyball federation of uh, Montenegro and uh, register and come. I see his name here in the list uh, from Turkish. Uh, there is a uh, Antonion from Greek. Oh, yeah, okay, okay. Um, uh, uh, from Slovenia. Uh, is anybody from Slovenia? Okay. Two. Yes, okay. Uh, from uh, Bosnia. Okay. And from Serbia, yes. And the rest of uh, from uh, Montenegro, naturally. Okay, we are very pleased to have uh, this international class. You know, this is an international class because usually when we have a course in Iran, you know, of course I had course in India. Uh, they had two Japanese over there, uh, but uh, this class is uh, excellent. You know, uh, we have a variety of uh, coaches from different country. This is good experience for us, and uh, hopefully we'll be able to do it good. And uh, la I look forward to the last day that everybody pass this class and everybody successfully go back. Uh, for today, uh, for the next, uh, I, I want uh, you to take a. Uh, short break and then uh, we are going to talk about a little bit about the history of the FIVB and uh, three years ago I worked with the coach from Japan in Iran named Tatsuya Adachi he was very good instructor from Japan you know the Japanese are very good at it. unfortunately year after that he died uh, He's been teach he, he, he taught uh, for yeah. Uh, I had uh, several courses with him in Iran, and uh, two years ago, I guess, yeah, exactly two years ago, I had the class with him in Iran, and uh, he was the director of the class. I was uh, helping him. Uh, year after that, he died. Uh, he uh, prepared the the the. the the material I present for uh, FIBB history, 
is the material he prepared and he gave us in that class so I try to remember him because he was he was very good uh, uh, he was professional teacher for FIBB and a good background in volleyball from Japan Japan uh, so we take a short break and then we come back and uh, we go over the history of uh, FIBB. Uh, this is something that uh, we should know about our uh, international federation. What is FIBB and who is the president? In that uh, period that we talk about uh, FIBB, there are some dates and there are some names that are important we know. Who were, who were the presidents, the first president, second president, third president, now fourth president of uh, the, the Brazilian Dr. Graca, and uh, some dates that we should know about uh, the history of volleyball, who started the volleyball, where they started the volleyball. This is something we are, we are going over. and. Uh, uh, if there is a date or time uh, name, we emphasize that, and uh, I'm sure you are taking note and uh, whatever is required, you know. Or... Okay. Okay. Ten thirty. Uh, sorry. Nine. Nine thirty. <laughs> Thank you.